I'm in the foothills at about 7,500 feet above Golden, Colorado, where we've had moderate snow all morning so far, with the visibility dropping down to a half a mile at times, and that light to moderate snow extends all the way down through the Denver area, causing some slippery spots along Interstate 70, especially as you go up in elevation. Uh, the eastern-facing slopes of the Colorado Front Range could easily see a foot of snow from this fast-moving system, and this is the same storm system that's going to spread snowfall down through the Texas Pan handle where winter storm warnings are in effect including the Amarillo area could easily see seven or eight inches of snow depending on where that heaviest snow band sets up down in the adjacent southern plains and this storm system will continue moving off to the east but here in the Colorado foothills this is contributing more to this record-breaking start uh, especially off in the higher mountains of Colorado uh, Loveland Colorado has had over 80 inches of snow and could easily already approach 100 inches so far this season and it's only early November and hopefully this is a sign of things to come for the Colorado ski season. I'm right along Interstate 70, just west of Denver, right at the Genesee, Colorado exit. And here you can see traffic is going relatively slow. At this point, the road on I-70 is just beginning to become snow covered. But as you go up in elevation, just a little bit up from here, about 500 feet or so, these roads are snow covered and slippery. Road crews are hard at work to try to keep these roads clear, but these are likely all skiers heading westbound on I-70 to take advantage of these new powder conditions where up to 10 to 12 inches of snow could fall on the eastern facing slopes of the Colorado Front Range. But this snow continues down into the Denver metro area with travel problems on these main roads. Thankfully, it is a weekend. So this morning, the traffic isn't nearly what it normally is on a weekday. This would be causing some serious problems out here. Uh, winter weather advisory is in effect until about 4 p.m. for this fast moving storm system with four to 10 inches of snow with the highest totals up in the higher elevations closer to the continental divide with those lower totals to the east of I-25.